Hi there, thank you for joining me. Today we're going to be going through a quick Amazon haul and afterwards I will show you how to uh, get to Amazon real quick, okay? So first off, I got this set of six lovely wax seal stamps. You can see, I don't know that I'll use the crayon much, but they're lovely. With a handle. And this was $4.00. And the Amazon warehouse price was $4. I couldn't find the original price of this listing. So then I searched for six-piece wax seal stamp sets. And the next cheapest price I could find was $13.99. Now, I don't know what this set was originally. Okay? But uh, you know how expensive wax seal stamps stamps are. So I'm saying I'm just going by the next cheapest price and I'm saying I saved $9.99 on that. The next thing I got was um, it's called School Smart Graph Paper 10 by 10 and and it's 500 sheets. You can see how much it is. It's a couple inches of paper. It's a lot. And um, it was originally in this package and um the package was torn a lot of amazon warehouse is just packaging damage it's not always returns it's it just says item will be repackaged and you can see here which if you're dealing with any paper you're gonna have some bins and folds i mean 500 sheets of thin slick paper, you know, you're just going to have some damage anyway. I do with my own copy paper. But you can see up here in the corner, there's a little bit of bend going on. And it's just a few pages. I mean, the whole ream is perfect. But it's just a few pages at the top. It goes that far. But that's only a little bit of the page. You know, I won't, I've never made a 10 foot tall, a 10 inch tall journal. But this paper I was excited to get because it's 10 by 10. So, it's great for journals because you know how it's hard to get paper wide, wide enough for the full width of a signature. And so this is big enough for any journal I make. And um, the grid is one by one. And I've never seen anyone use this kind of paper before. So... I had in this whole ream of paper, which is 500 sheets, which is standard for ream count, for paper weight is 500 sheets, and for cardstock weight is 250 sheets. So this ream of 500 sheets of this 10 by 10 graph paper was 303, and then the full price is 13 1872, and so I saved 1569, which I also bought this previously in May for 501 and um, so full price still savings for for two reams of this paper which is a thousand sheets I spent 804 and I saved 2940 okay so this is just a, a good example of the bargains you can get on warehouse I'm going to show you real quick how to navigate Amazon Warehouse. Let me get rid of the light. Okay. So it's right here. And I do this on a browser page on my tablet or my laptop. I prefer the navigation of a browser page versus the app or a phone or something. You can't I I've never I don't know how to navigate it on anything else. I prefer a browser page. Okay? And you can navigate this just on a tablet on a Chrome browser. I like Chrome. But you don't even have to do desktop site. You can just do a regular Chrome. Okay? So it's right here at the top. The drop down we're all used to. Right? And it's right here. Amazon Warehouse. It's, that, it's just part of Amazon. You can type in something you're looking for, like glue or light bulbs or whatever you need, right? Or you can just hit go or search, and then you then you come to the whole warehouse experience, okay? 
and it has your categories over here just like we're always used to seeing right um, of course I look at office products okay I look at home and kitchen they have a neat organization section and um, I'm going to show you a path for paper such as this this path I don't know why it's here my sister said she learned it the last time I showed it but uh, this is a path you need to know for office paper this path shows office paper and scrapbook paper okay and so it's arts craft sewing and I'll zoom this up in a minute down here at the bottom there's a scrapbooking and stamping section and in here is paper and cardstock and I will zoom this up and show you this path because this is all paper this is Amazon warehouse arts craft and sewing scrapbooking and stamping paper and cardstock I don't know why it's here this is the best path to find all paper it's office paper reams of 500 paper or 250 cardstock or scrapbook paper so we're going to go low to high and I'll show you something this is my uh, repeated attempt trying to make this video but they just have all kinds of like here vintage scrapbook paper supplies you know um, here's glitter paper um, here's cardstock here's paper pads I've never paid these prices I've I whenever I'm searching okay if you're searching so if you're searching for something you want you're gonna you're gonna go a little more but if you're just searching to see what bargains are out there you're I I quit scrolling at about three to five dollars because if you're if you're just looking for something you didn't even know you wanted or needed it's different right um so I'm going to show you something I found on here earlier. Okay, this is great. This is Nina Paper Exact Index. I have this in tan, cream, pink, coral, and light green. And this is 250 sheets of ream, which is standard for cardstock weight. Okay? And I've never paid this much. It's $10.59. Warehouse always changes. So if you see something, you need to get it. If you see something you want. But it's always changing. So the there was probably this same paper on there for $3 an hour ago. Okay? So it's $10.59, which may seem kind of high. But if you look here, the full price is $20.25. So it's half price for... Uh, ream of 250 sheets of cardstock now I'm going to show you something I saw a minute ago and they have colored cardstock here's uh and 250 sheets you want to make sure you get that like this paper is only 50 which it might be fine parchment C which 50 sheets might be plenty okay um but I want to show you something I saw on here a minute ago which was pretty cool here we go. Nope. That's not it. You're not going to believe this bargain. It's probably gone. Here we go. Look here. Hammer mill. You're not going to believe this. Hammer mill cardstock, cardstock premium paper color copy 80 pound 11 by 17 and it's a four pack. So 11 by 17 is double eight and a half by 11. If you put two pieces of eight and a half by 11 paper side by side, they will measure to be 11 by 17. So this is a thousand sheets of 11 by 17 four pack. So if you were to cut all of these in half, it would literally be 2,000 sheets of letter size okay and it's cardstock okay and
and so it would it's a case of cardstock so it's four reams of 11 by 17 which would be eight reams of eight and a half by 11 okay see all buying options you're not going to believe this i can't get over it so you see here for used where did it go Well, I'll show you on the last sheet. But look how much new is. $196.50. So this is a 200 Oh, and here, one option from $17. So this is a $195 case of white cardstock for 70 17 dollars okay and it says four pack but that's really eight pack of letter size okay these are the kind of bargains you can get on warehouse and that's it's that easy to get to you shop amazon warehouse and then you go and then they have all of the categories you're used to Did you order that cardstock? no Really? Don't you well, my daughter is in the other room saying I need to order that. So I will as soon as I get off of here. But I don't need 2,000 sheets of cardstock. So if anybody wants to buy any, let me know. Okay? Um, so I will be buying that. And um, let me know what deals you get off of Amazon warehouse and then today's deals for both of these for 500 sheets of this paper which is 10 by 10 one by one grid love it love it and these six wax seal stamp wax seal stamps i don't know why that's hard to say which they're lovely with the handle today i spent 703 for both of these okay and this for both of these items 19 23 33 dollars and so i saved over 25 dollars just on these two things which i will gladly use and love okay thanks so much for watching love you bye